to, but shout out to Kiera. There ain't no wine like Kiera wine. Mm -hmm. That's first and foremost. All right, so listen yeah, to this. It says, Vince McMahon, who co-founded the modern WWE in 1982, has resigned from his role as TKO executive chairman and from his position on the TKO board of directors. He said in a statement provided to ESPN on Friday night, McMahon, 78, damn, leaves the publicly traded company, which was formed when UFC merged with WWE last year following a lawsuit filed Thursday that accuses him of sexual misconduct. They said do him like Bill Cosby. Nah, In the lawsuit, Trump shit. Janelle Grant. Pussy. Come on, y'all. In the lawsuit, <laughs> Janelle Grant, who worked in WWE's legal and talent departments, alleges that McMahon forced her into a sexual relationship in order for her to obtain and keep her job and passed around pornographic pictures and videos of her to other men, including mm. other employees. The lawsuit, which was filed in the U.S. District Court in Connecticut, where WWE is headquartered, also names WWE and John Laurinaitis, the company's former head of talent relations and general manager, as defendants. Mm. Hmm. It's always the ones with the, with the money, bro. And yeah. they're not settling this time because this ain't his first time. Bro, going that, through this, but it's never none of their first time. This, the, you I know, can dig like, it. like, 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 because we. I don't even really want to get too deep into this because for me, it's going to go into a whole nother conversation. Yeah, yeah. And where, where situations tied into shit like this, but all I'm what I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a, I'm a end with saying this though. A lot of shit that be, we be paying attention to has been something a part of either a this person's character or this person's resume. Every dog had a day. Mm -hmm. You feel what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. it had, it, this is not the first or nor what what it, it, it may be the last time. Who's to say? Mm -mm. Maybe for it's, him, but maybe for not, him. Not, but yeah, in history, this is what I'm saying. This is gonna but, be an ongoing but situation. It's a, but this exactly. is not the this is not the first time. Mm -hmm. And every and now all of us it'd be certain times now that it's reiterated to where we've paid more attention than we did the last time or the time before that. Mm -hmm. What a, what makes it different this time? And see exactly what's or what's gonna make the next this, time this, any cause, different. Because if you ask mm -hmm. me, the money, the, the money, the, the, the digits of the money is the only thing that's different from the first time to now. He got more money than he now than he did then. They they got him. They got text messages. He he's in some deep shit for some crazy shit right but, now. I, man, look, man, he, they, I think he's he gonna be he all right. He was guaranteeing because, Brock Lesnar in his last contract that he signed with Vince McMahon. One of the stipulations was that he got to fuck this girl. Shit. Uh, he had a threesome with Vince McMahon and that talent head of talent guy. They had a threesome with this girl. Well, they were in a train. Recorded though. it. They were in a train. And he was showing it. So to was the, Brock to, the, to the crew. And he said he texted the girl. Said, "Hey, I was showing it to the guys. I counted. There's twelve of them. They all want to fuck. I told them they got to do it all at the same time, and it's got to be three at least at one time." Damn. These are text messages that he's sending. Go ahead and ask the question that we both want to know. I heard. I heard it coming. So is Brock Lesnar gonna testify in court? I don't know. I want to be. I want. I don't go. know. But they got him. Yeah. He he was texting people this, that, talking about he uh, he shit on this girl's head and made her continue pleasing him while she was going through that. Like it's mm. bad. It is completely different. Damn, Vince, <laughs> you a nasty mother. <laughs> hey, Chuck. I was uh. trying to find the list, but I figured I just spit what I've heard. What so you what you know so far. Hey man, it's a dirty this, game, boy. But it, but this just it's it's not, it's not dirty. Why ain't it? It's, it's, is it is it is it is it who is it dirty to? Because again, to the person that allows it. But because the because the what what we what this man has just said is shit that has been going on and has been in our face. Mm -hmm. For years, that don't make it undirty. That don't make it. Then say, but this is the thing though. It's only undirty to the people who 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 are not in a position to do the shit. Uh huh. Not willing to do the shit. People, this is okay. How can okay? I'm gonna say it like this. A lot of the fucked up and the most heinous shit comes from people who has money. Yeah. Right. Mm -hmm. Yeah. What does money do to the most common person? Average person, 
it changed their whole attitude. And they end up doing shit that they what they would normally what never do. Wouldn't do. My point. So again, it's the power trip, boy. So so again, yeah. Who is it dirty to? The, because because, 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 it, because, because it's self, oh, really like because if because if because if we us us being humans, right? If we could do some of the shit that we didn't thought about doing, yeah, and get away with it, yeah. Hey, you ain't lying. We would do it. You ain't lying. That's why I like hey, acting. You and, ain't lying, boy. And, hey. and, and, and so and 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 yeah. so and so who, and who is it dirty? So, to? so who is who, does, yeah. who is the dirty to? Yeah, because you out of millions of millions of billions mm. billions of people are thinking the same type of shit. Mm-hmm. And then it'd it be so like who but, is the dirty? But at the same time, we all have we all think fucked up shit, right? You know what I'm saying? But it's just a thought. Until you actually do the shit, you know what I'm saying. So it's like, yeah, you you being fucked up to yourself. But ladies might not want to hear this either. Once you let that shit slide one time, you know what I mean. I mean, shit, whose fault is it really? You know what I mean. Yeah, you you got a life to live. You trying to pay your bills. You trying to take care of your family. This, that, and the third. But shit, ain't nobody making you choose this endeavor or you know what I'm saying? Ain't no, you know what I'm saying? I'm not saying what, you know what I'm saying? Everybody got circumstances. You know what I'm saying? It's, 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 it's broad. You know what I mean? Like you can't really say like, <laughs> I, I agree with what you're saying. Cause like you really can't point at him and say like, yeah, he's fucked up. But then again, it's like, Everybody's accountable for their own actions. You heard what no, you I'm not dispute, I don't dispute that. Yeah. You heard what he said, let. You know how you said let, right? When you said Vince McMahon was recording and all that shit, and she let. Oh, I I don't know. It's just like the certain like some motherfuckers don't be taking account. But I'm not defending none of the shit that he doing. Right. But you gotta look at it from you gotta look at it for what it is. Cause you seen situations to where a nigga whole career got fucked up just because a white a motherfucker lied on him. Just you feel me? Yeah. Listen, my, 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 my thing. Deshaun Watson, shout out. <laughs> my my. So my thing my thing my thing with saying this is and. Before I say what I'm about to say, I'm, I'm gonna take the time to say this. I believe in a woman having her own rights. Yes, for sure. Mm-hmm. Being in control of her own body. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? Um, and I also believe in uh, 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 their ability to be able to speak up and to be justified in whatever wrongdoing that has mm-hmm. been done. You know what I'm saying? Towards them. Mm-hmm. With that being said. It's okay until it's not. Yeah. Uh huh. You can be in the most. You can sit here and tell the world how uncomfortable you are, what happened, how you felt, and you may have really felt this way, but mm-hmm. you accepted whatever it was, for whatever reason that you felt the need to accept what the what what was going what on. was going on at that moment. Yeah. So this woman accepted whatever the fuck was going on because they don't tell her how long this shit. Yeah, no cap. Yeah, and I understand it ain't really easy for a woman. You know what I mean? Like, cause especially going to get up against a man. You know what I'm mm-hmm. saying? Like, and these type of this, that's this, very man, this man got billion millions of dollars. Mm-hmm. Yeah, she probably just felt uncomfortable, and then she's like, "Damn, I got to." Cause you feel me? Yeah, I see what you're saying. So, I don't, yeah. so, so, I don't, so again, I don't take. I don't. So that's why I said what I said. I don't take because a lot of times I have a question. I be wondering, why did you wait so long to say something? Yeah, it, that's why. What 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 made you hold your tongue thus far thus long? After you've seen three other people do it, and now you want to say something. See, and I don't know if you've experienced this yet in life, but we've been. Uh, doing we've been adulting a little bit longer than you, so I'm sure we've all been in a situation where a female has played the hard to get. Uh, no, don't, no, like she like the fake fight off thing. Mm-hmm. Anytime a female has ever played that role with me, I've really stopped. No, don't. Yeah, do what? Well, don't relax. Do, because this is the this could be the the deal breaker for mm-hmm. you know what I mean. Uh, you could spin this into a whole nother narrative because. You feel some type of way later on down the line. I told you to stop. Like, yeah, it, well, ooh, we. you know what I mean? Yeah. Like, so anytime I've ever been in a situation with a female where we was taking it there and they've made it seem like stop, even if they didn't mean, I don't give a fuck. The what, first sign. Fall back. And, 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 and for real, with. for real, like what, 
what makes me me being an uh, I'm an observant person, mm-hmm. right? You really only hear about this shit from people who have again money, exactly. Who has wealth? The nigga that's on the corner bumming and panhandling, bro. You don't hear about nobody t- saying that he for, he took they he raped them, touched them inappropriately, or none of that shit. Mm-hmm. Exactly. They're not trying to sue him because they don't hate. Has nothing to give them. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. But it's all. But you're going to forever hear about this from somebody who has some okay. type of substantial. I see where you're going. Amount of money. Because mm-hmm. you got to realize. And again, and so because because money rules the world, mm-hmm. it's okay until it's not okay. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? That's like, again, I ain't want to, because I feel, the R, whole R. Kelly situation. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? The whole, the whole, uh, 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 like, I feel like a lot of these women, a lot of these people accept whatever they're going to accept because it's good. It puts them in a different lifestyle. It puts them in a different position than where they were before. So they're willing, they are literally selling their soul for that dollar. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. But when the well runs dry or the person that is dishing out is not willing to continue to do what it is that you've been asking them to do. Mm-hmm. Now I did some Now extra all foul of a sudden shit. I done did some extra foul shit, but you've been fucking knowing, so you just as guilty mm-hmm. and wrong as this person because mm-hmm. you've been feeding their whole appetite. Mm-hmm. This nigga's been a child molester, whatever the fuck you want to call it. Man, you, 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 hit, you put something in my head, man. I don't know if y'all seen that Cam Capone News interview with Orlando Brown. Not yet. But... He was pretty much touched based on that kind of situation uh-huh. to where it's like once these once these people get into into uh, into these situations, you know what I mean. The, all of a sudden, the hazing process, you know what I'm saying, is too much for them. Yeah. You know what I mean. And now, you know what I'm saying. They they want to run and tell. You know what I mean. Things like that. But he was saying like, motherfucker, you knew what you was getting into. You know what I mean. Like you knew what you signed up for in a sense. You know what I'm saying. So like, I kind of believe that. You know what I mean. <laughs> but that was just that was just a little sidebar that I wanted to put in. Okay. So closing set uh, closing segment. Anybody <clears throat> got anything they want to say before we go into the next topic? Nah. I just you want me to tell you what I'm gonna say. Go ahead, player. Whatever they said. As long as Vince McMahon keep that little cat burglar mustache, I believe him. <laughs> Cut that little weird ass mustache <laughs> off until you look. You, you run around this motherfucker looking like Wario. <laughs> I don't trust nothing you say, motherfucker, until you cut that fucking suspicious ass mustache. He got that goddamn investigator mustache. Yeah, bro, you look like you up to something. Yeah, 